So today we're going to talk about past due assignments and due dates for competency-based learning. Competency-based learning does have due dates. We understand that some students need more time to learn, and in that scenario, there's ways of, noted, of showing that in Slate, but we still have due dates. If students get an extension, it is a teacher agreed upon contracted extension of time. Basically, the teacher and the student would work it out, and they would be allowed to continue if that was appropriate. So to look where past due assignments are, you're going to want to go to the task dashboard. So I'm going there. I'm going to make sure we can see everything. As a student, me being the demo student, I'm not doing very well because I have a lot of red on here. Red means it's past due. Blue means the teacher's mark that is completed. And it may have been rated. It may not have been rated. It may have been a, a supporting task, but blue means it's completed. Yellow means revision. So I see a lot on here that's past due. I do want to look at one of them. Sometimes past due means past due. It just wasn't turned in on time. Sometimes it means that it's a situation like this. The student got no rating. Um, it was handed back for revision. At the bottom here, we can see it says, please reference the data in your explanation for a higher score and more robust explanation. So I would have had a conversation or the teacher would have had a conversation with me about this assignment. I had been told how to make it better. It was given back for a revision. A new due date was set, and that due date has also passed, which is why it's red. So if it's red, whether it's been sent back for revision or not, it is past due. Anything red means past due. 